What is going on everybody? Welcome to another custom Black Ops 3 Zombies map. This is called Truck Stop. And I played this one on stream just the other day. I am coming back to finally beat it. I mean, I essentially had beat it. I got the ending unlocked. It just didn't have enough points to actually fully buy when I died. Called it good at that, so I'm going to actually try to fully beat it this time. And I gotta fill all these soul fillers because you know soul fillers are the thing these days. Why can I not buy the dragon off? Like, why prevent me from buying it but having it lay right there with mags and everything? All right, zombies. Need you to get close so I can. Sacrifice your souls. Try to make points in the process, too. Oh, that's a nice bonus 400 points. This is a cool map. It's got like the Black Ops 2 kind of look and feel about it. I mean, the HUD and the guns are basically all from Black Ops 2. So, fits very nicely. Definitely like it. Alright, now that gun's useless. Uh, why is that zombie so tough? Like, holy cow. Pretty sure he just took like four headshots. Oh, that one's still alive? Okay. I feel like it's taking a lot more souls to fill this one than it did when I played on stream. Um, I don't know if this map updated, but if it did, I hope we didn't bump up the soul amounts. That would not be fun. Would not be fun at all. M14's a one-shot still. That's Alright, basically done here, I need to, is that the, there, okay, there's the debris, basically I just need to take them down here to the next set of soul fillers, please give me something decent, alright, that works, uh, okay, it's right here, oh yes, you rolling zombies, Ammo. Why does it like glitch out when I try to switch weapons? I, th I that's just a Black Ops 3 thing, but I've never figured out why it does it. It's like I scroll once sometimes and it'll be fine, but if I do a double scroll, it like bugs out the gun. Oh, this. Oh, come on. So I'm pretty sure if I open this, power is here, and there's a soul filler in here, which I don't know if I would even attempt, but it has to be done, unfortunately. I don't know if I should just go ahead and buy this. All right, a death machine. All right. Death machine is slightly weak in this. Forgot about that. 45 minute reload. Zombies will take forever to get here as well. Take you all in here real quick. Can I actually fill this one? The perk bottle. 
pretty sure the perk bottles give me extra perk slots. Oh, right. Okay, they got around the corner to even fill. Alrighty, Ooh, hello there. Yeah, you do the sidestep. That way I don't have to deal with you. Get some extra points. Uh, I'm just kind of waiting and dreading for a... Uh... Is there a part? Oh, it's a shield part. I couldn't see it hardly. I think I need to remember to also bump up the uh, brightness because it's dark on screen. Uh, Alright, knife fest. Epic if uh, this filler drops me a nuke. Go ahead and get out of this place a little easier. Yeah, that's a napalm. Can I build the barrier and keep him out? Tense for a second, but it's all good. We're not dead yet. <laughs> should, I, should, I should go ahead and just detonate him back here. There we go. That oh, way well, he's not a problem. Right, hopefully, this Type 25 is not terrible. I know in Black Ops 2 it's okay, but the recoil is just so insane on it because you know oh we need to balance weapons and zombies by jacking the recoil through the roof that's a uh, it's good balance because, you know, accuracy really is the problem in zombies all right we'll grab that extra points Screamer zombie as well. Okay, I need to open that. Okay, I really need to get back over here. I need to do that. And there is Jug, so this will make life easy. And I guess I'll go ahead and buy the MP5. There is a soul filler there. Alright. How bad is the Type 25? One shot? Okay. We'll keep it for now. What? What the heck? I'm pretty sure the zombie was dead. Somehow, still hit me. So weird. Okay, come on, zombies! I need your souls. Play nicely now. No more lag switching to get free hits on me. Alright. Go ahead and open the next area because I believe double tap is right here. Grab that. I think Speed Cola's in there. I don't have enough yet. So, uh, 
soul filler there. I don't think they would have added more. Get rid of that dude. Do not need him doing his thing. Kind of annoying that the um, the soul filler is directional somewhat. Like if they're on the other side of that blue cart, like this side here, I can't actually get them to fill. It's kind of annoying. It's for whatever reason, they like to linger where it's not able to collect them from. Here, fire. Napalm zombie. Right. You know what? If you're going to take your time, zombies, I'm going to go ahead and buy speed cola. Oh, wow. You're really fast. And of course, the napalm zombies there. I want to go back and get stamina up, actually. Yeah, of course he killed the zombie. That's fine. It's fine. We'll just go and run and get stamina real quick. Stamina up. Hopefully we can run all the way back now. It's always fun how these maps, like the first time or two you play them, it, you'll struggle so badly, but once you come back like the second, third, or fourth time, usually it's much easier just because you know everything. I mean, sometimes it's not that it that way. Sometimes maps are just really hard and randomize everything really bad, but... Alright, how much is this? 3,000? Why? Uh, he didn't go off. Alright. Got enough now. So, the other soul filler was... That's the teleporter. Oh, it's right there. That should open up those bamboo shoots over there. Actually, I already have access to pack a so I could get that M16 and upgrade it. You want to be a little slower, zombie? Any other time, they'd be sprinting at me like just absolute madmen, but no, we're going to walk this time, eh? apparently. Uh, I don't even know if I want to worry about the symbol monkeys. I don't even know where the parts are at. Too bad I couldn't use that mini gun turn or sentry gun turn. Right. Spawn there. Map is just a little bit framing. I don't know if it's just because of all the detail and how, like, spread out the map is, or... It's definitely taking a lot of souls. There is also a soul filler over here I forgot about. Will this count for souls? It does. Alright, I need that M16 anyways. Bottom mule kick as well. I don't think I can buy any more perks. I think that's my perk limit. I wonder if there's a gun out there or not. 
It was just a soul filler in an end game, I believe. A napalm zombie coming in. M16 is a one burst. So hit two, three shots, anyways. Got a nuke on standby. Don't like when they roll like that. It makes them somewhat hard to kill. Do all that. So, was this just ammo? One soul filler. Alright. Let's make sure we detonate this man. Then I need to go get a mule kick gun and just build the absolute crap out of some points. Not sure if I'll do an edited up video for this one or if I'll just make this a solid gameplay video. I've already played it on stream once, so I guess technically that would be a solid gameplay. I think I just shot a perk bottle by accident. The last one I shot made that sound. I just heard it. Might be the last one. Not the last one, but end of round. Run back and hit the box and like the teleporter. Pack the old M16 up. So link that. Hit the box, probably get something stupid. I mean, point builder, take it. Alright, we'll try the peacekeeper a little bit. I don't know if it's ain't good, but we'll try it. Go ahead and go pack a punch real quick. That way I have a full auto M16 at the very least. Nobody likes three-round burst weapons. The idea is there, but the uh, execution of it is not. Oh, that's dang going. I forgot it takes points to teleport, which is so dumb. Where are you at, zombie? That dude's got a got a radio. Can we call for help? <laughs> what if I could stand in here? Is this safe? Is this a smart idea? I bet it would be if I had monkey bombs. Which, I don't know if I ought to try to find the parts for or not. Maybe not. Problem with camping on this map is, um, well, napalms are a thing. Well, as uh, shriekers, which they're not as bad, but plus zombies do that, and that just it's painful. Oh, there's a fiery dude somewhere. Is there a dead shot? I really can use some better hip fire. Where's the flamey one at? I think there is dead shot. I think it's over by power, if I remember. Or maybe I'm totally crazy and it doesn't exist in this map. <laughs> Greatest perk on PC ever! 
Oh, it is here. There we go. Now I don't have to aim anymore. With all my mouse sensitivity doesn't drop anymore. Jeez. It's getting sort of difficult to look around quickly. Alright, I need to go... Uh, honestly, I would like to double pack, maybe, even. If that's the case. Almost enough. Almost. I wonder if I could chill out kind of right here. I do have a trap, also. I don't... What if the trap machine guns would actually delete the uh, napalm or if it'll ignore them sometimes traps like that just ignore ball zombies sometimes they actually just instantly delete them oh. making me use my m16 some more Actually, it might be a good camping spot here. I can kind of directionalize my aim. Oh, he did a roll. Dang on it. When I do a roll, I can't trigger him. Oh well. Oh, wow, feels like it's only round 10, but it's actually round 16. I guess these guns are just nice and strong instead of being absolutely weak. Like a lot of, the, uh, a lot of times Black Ops 2 guns were. Switch to this gun. Probably shouldn't try to shoot him to death. That's probably not a good idea. Go away, flamey one. Of course. Um, probably just wait to the end of the round to teleport. That way I don't spawn back in and have to face off like 15 million zombies standing around where I teleport. That's never happened in zombies ever. Definitely getting some pretty hard lag spikes. Like the frames just tanking out for some reason. Probably because there's a lot of foliage and like high level of detail in this map. And considering how probably expansive it is from one side to another, it probably doesn't like when I whip around. Where are you at, little screamy boy? Where be the screamer? Should be coming running at Mach 5 here any second.
I don't know, it doesn't matter. Tap the teleport. What is one? Don't think I really need it. Ball crusher. Do that. Triple back, why not? Tech, two or three, red dot, and looks like it has a four grip on it as well, does it? Yeah, because M16 is the only one with a grenade launcher. Man, this guy is completely overpowered. So, no symbol monkey part. Interesting. Oh well. Back to the corner of uh, safety, I suppose. Yeah, this gun just absolutely one taps. Look, it's a one tap to the body, even. Yeah. Holy cow. Oh, except that that round is made. That'll definitely one tap some people. Good. Maybe not. That machine is not very strong. <laughs> Gotta reload. Alright. Uh... Make sure he hasn't changed, like, the ending price. That would be annoying. Like, oh, I got enough, I got enough, and then, uh, wait, no, it's not, like, 60,000 still. Yeah, so I shot that jug bottle, I think, by accident. I think that's the one I found while I was playing on stream. Is okay. We definitely need the perks. And make it more fun. Why the heck that screamer still scream? Even that was dead on the facial as well, I should probably actually win teleporter, so I have like an emergency escape route of sorts. One. Run back and link the teleporter. There we go, link that. I'm gonna hit the box to see if I get something more fun. No. Cool, but not fun. Not good for uh beating the map. Considering it has like... Oh! There's a napalm. Dude has like the blast radius of a nuclear bomb too. Alright. Do, do, do. It's so fun these guns are just extremely overpowered in this map. That. 
Oh, I can uh, full sprint and shoot. I was about to say run and shoot, but you kind of can do that anyway. It's crazy how uh, Call of Duty's always had that. Oh, you could run so fast and shoot and do all this crazy stuff while full sprint. But if you've ever tried to do that in your life, like just even holding a gun by itself in your hand, try to run and shoot somewhat accurately. It's very difficult. Like, if you want to even have any sort of semblance of accuracy, you need to basically be walking to, uh, shoot. Now, of course, there's those people that really train, and they're good with stuff like that. They're like, high-speed special operations people can do stuff like this, but your average Joe can't just pick up a an M16 and start running full sprint and then start shooting. Like, you just can't do that. Not accurately, anyways. I mean, you can do it, but you're probably going to hit something you definitely don't want to shoot. <laughs> oh, that's not bad. Almost just hip fire these people. Palm zombie down there. Weird how this EOTech almost acts more like an ACOG site. It's just got such high magnification on it. Got rid of that dude. Wait for the next round. Try to text real quick. Back to shooting zombies. Just grab that because they're not. Right. Wait on the zombies again now. <laughs> And I am in this. It's okay. <laughs> Only got three other gun or two other guns with full ammo. Well, I think I'm buy ammo for one of them. Oh, uh, fourteen thousand more points. That's all I need. Think, right? Sixty thousand. Yeah. It is an ammo machine. I don't know if it's a max ammo or if it's just ammo for current weapon. Either way, no big deal. Ooh, death machine. Free ammo now. Just do not lay off the trigger ever. Flamer. And there's the screecher. Yeah. 
Make him go away. Make that zombie's head go away, too. <laughs> 5,000 more points. This is probably like where I'm going to die now. These headlights are extremely bright. I'm assuming this is supposed to be daylight, and yet it's pretty bright. It's a cool looking map, though. Like, he's even got, like, the distant, like, terrain and textures and buildings and stuff going on. Pretty cool. Alright, I can get back to using the Peacekeeper a little bit. Not even sure how to uh, pronounce the pack punch name on this gun. Alright, we got enough. Let's get out of here. We've seen enough of this truck stop for one day. Alrighty, thank you all for watching. This is extremely loud, but... Anyways, I beat the map finally. I will catch you all <laughs> in the next one.